A Turkish pop singer was indicted and can, could face up to three years in prison for making one Muslim joke at one concert once. She pictured here was jailed for four days and is facing again trial for three years because Golson made one joke. She joked that one of her musician's perversion came from the religious school that he attended, Imam Hatep, in Turkey. This particular school, which was attended by their president and others, is designed to train the next generation of imams. See, my point in this is, and we'll see what the courts decide, but you kind of know where it's going to go, right? My point in this is all religions are not the same. Any man-made religion will be very for, firm. We, we have these, these pie-in-the-sky ideals that we just love and accept each other, we'll all get along. But, but you see what happens when other religions and other worlds have adopted a different worldview. You make a joke against us, we're going to incarcerate, we're going to indict, and we're going to try to imprison you for years because you made one joke at one concert. This idea that we're all some version of the same religion and we just all found it on values and acceptance, well, that works until you make a joke at a concert, huh? My point is, is that the lie of our culture that we're all ecumenically the same isn't true. You need something better than a lie that doesn't hold up in court. Psalm 119, Lamed. Save me, for I am yours. I have sought out your precepts. I've sought out your precepts. Not the teachings of this world. Not the cultural values that it says it holds, but it won't hold for long. Save me, I'm yours. It's something to be owned by, loved by, cared for by our Father. You, you can follow other religions. You're, you're free to choose. You can follow other teachings. You're free to choose. But, but the Christian one is a God, our Father, who actually loves and cares for us and makes us his own and always wants you by his side.